With the film now out worldwide, Shazam! Fury of the Gods is starting to see more reviews coming from critics. And as a film that already started with under an 80 on Rotten Tomatoes, it's not surprising that we're now over 100 reviews and the film is officially rotten. So I just checked the review score right before I started this video and it was sitting at a 51%. Now again, there's always processing and lead times on reviews and when they show up officially and also as they're being processed, that's why sometimes if you refresh it, you get different scores and different amounts of reviews, just to clarify that. So is there a chance, like somebody's gonna bring it up in the comments, that it goes up? Yes, there's a chance that the next 30 reviews come in and they're like, you know, eight nines and tens that's very possible is it going to happen typically not it's typically always uh downwards now why exactly is this a big deal well this film was already going to be struggling at the box office and we know we can directly connect the dots now and see a correlation between review scores and the box office results i know some people like to still deny it say there's nothing here there definitely is we can now see it tons of films have seen their reviews impact the final box office. With Shazam, honestly, uh, you know, not to beat a dead horse at this point, but it was always an uphill battle with this film. The first one did what it needed to. It wasn't profitable. This film never looked like it was going to be that profitable to begin with. So what you're left with is what we're looking at here. A abysmal global box office take, bad reviews, you combo that up together, you look at what happened with other films, it's not a good look. Um, honestly, it's a pretty terrible look. And it'll be interesting to see what they do in regards to the messaging and what they're going to do in regards to the push for this film coming into its second and third weekend. Because the competition is already stiff this weekend. Why does this keep going out of focus? It's still stiff, and it's going to continue to be, with the likes of Dungeons & Dragons, which is getting shockingly good reviews, another John Wick film, and more things coming at us. Um, whatever happens, though, we'll cover it, but right now, this rotten score that keeps on sinking could honestly turn out much worse. There's a chance that this thing could be reviewed lower, substantially lower, than Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumania, which, that'll be interesting.